Hey, what is up guys? Thank you for all your support on my finding the Shadow Man in the trailer video. I don't know if it is him, obviously, um, it's only a theory, but the thing that does actually support it is the trailer that was revealed today about the four characters. It actually has a scene where the box is in the arena and we see a little bit and I believe it's from the Shadow Man's perspective and he's watching the boxing match and it matches up in the same place where I think I found him in the original trailer. So yeah, that's really cool. So thank you anyway for all your support on that video. Now anyway, in this video today I'm going to be talking about the 2000 yellow sort of symbol on this panel with a red button. Now I've wanted to make this video for a long time but I couldn't really come up with anything that would make sense but now that the trophies have been leaked I think that I kind of have an idea sort of a theory what it could be. Now one of the trophies is Beat Cop and the trophy description is In Shadows of Evil summon the Civil Protector in every district in a single game. Now we don't know what the Civil Protector is, we don't know what he looks like, all we have is sort of like a mask in the trophy it sort of looks like um it says morgue city police department so i'm not sure that he's going to be a robot or a real person so that's going to be interesting to find out whether that is and in the case that he's actually a robot i can imagine he'll be similar to the robot bubby on infection on advanced warfare where he actually follows you around and kills all the zombies trying to attack you so yeah this is really useful and hopefully see a similar rendition in the fact that the civil protector could be similar to bubby but rather than having to do the easter egg like on infection you would simply be able to purchase him for a certain amount of time for example 2000 points which I'll go on to mention in a minute and I can imagine him looking something similar along the lines of Brutus of Mob of the Dead however he's actually on your side and after all Mob of the Dead and Shadows of Evil are believed to be linked so yeah that would make sense now this is the main part of the video and how he would actually be summoned. So I think he could be summoned from the red button where it says 2000 above it. I don't believe it's a perk and at this point in time there's nothing really else that I can think of other than the fact it summons him to the district. Now what we can see in the clearest picture of the 2000 button, we can see a little vent underneath. Now I either think he's going to come out from there or maybe we could go through there when we're in the sort of purgatory sort of squid mode. That's the only thing that I can think of. The fact that we can summon him in every district and it's only a bronze, that kind of means that it's going to be fairly straightforward trophy. The only thing that we've seen many times in the trailer which could be something that summons him is in fact the red button with the 2000 above it. Now if this is true it could potentially be a step in the easter egg. I can imagine something like similar to Shangri-La where all the characters have to press the button at the same time. Maybe it would summon the civil protector and he might actually bash down the door which has fire and a padlock over it. I think that would make sense if it is sort of like a robot. Um, the mask definitely does look like a robot in fact. But yeah, anyway guys, this is just like a little theory that I came up with. I don't know how true it is and I'm sure we'll find out soon enough when the game releases. So anyway guys, thank you for watching this video. I really appreciate it. Pack a punch that like button and I'll see you in my next video.